how you guys doing today? Christine Austin Ill. We got a plane going in front of us. However, we want to get this video out to you. This video is on selling out. You have to be 1000% sold out on your business if you want your business to be successful. Time and time again, you realize and you've heard the stories of successful people that have told you that they have failed several times. The only way that they were able to make it to success is by keep moving forward. That is why I am repping this shirt today. Um, I have some hats coming and some additional shirts that you guys are gonna be seeing throughout my um, course because we wanna be reminded that we need to keep moving forward through success. Today, I do have a visitor with me. His name is Gabriel Brown. We are um, money makers and movers and shakers through Lincoln Heritage. The Miles Group, but today we are talking about business. We are talking about business mindset. We're talking about keeping moving forward to success. Again, we're going from zero to six figures, and it starts in the mind. It starts with your thought process, and that is where the KMF started because he realized, and actually, I'm going to let him tell you about that, all right, because he could tell you his story better than anybody. So without further ado, here is Gay Brown. Yes, yes, yes. What's going on, Lifetime University? It's your boy, GB. That's how what our conference call. Just wanted to get in, give, give you a little bit of passion, a little energy, a little enthusiasm before yes. we get this party started. Hopefully you're excited. I'm excited to be a part of this. Thank you so much, Chrissy, for giving me the opportunity uh, to speak to your wonderful class. I've been paying attention. It's growing by leaps and bounds on a daily basis, and I am so excited uh, for your success, right? I'm gonna share just a little bit about my story. I've been in business uh, in, the, in the final expense industry for about 10 years now, right? And we're talking about going from zero to six figures, right? Well, that's kind of what exactly what happened when I got started with uh, this final expense business with Lincoln Heritage Life Insurance Company. The irony to uh, this KMF is that everything before this platform, everything before I was introduced to this platform, I was best known by quitting on things yes. before when they got tough, when the going got tough, you know? A lot of us, we get caught up thinking the grass is greener somewhere else, so we don't we don't push through. We don't continue to keep going, you know, uh, in our towards our goals, towards our dreams, towards our success, if you will, right? And that was me for the uh, for the, the past ten years prior to starting with uh, starting with Lincoln Heritage in, our, in the final expense industry, right? I used to quit on everything. I had multi level marketing businesses, six months done. Now on to the next, wow. right? I had a record label, right? Going got tough. GB got going, right? Quit on that. I've quit on jobs. I've quit on several other insurance ventures. And it wasn't until I discovered something, okay? I was watching a movie called Meet the Robinsons with my daughter. At the time, she was about two and a half, three years old. And there's a portion in the movie that talks about keep moving forward they say you know with success you don't learn much but with failure it's it, it's in the moving forward through your failure over and over and over again it's what's going to bring you to success whatever success means to you right and it resonated with me and it was right around the time I started in this industry right so first of all I had a real what we call a why factor Okay. Um, at the time, I got fired from my job. Okay. Um, my wife's a stay-at-home mom. I had a three-year-old at home, and oh, by the way, my wife was also pregnant with my son. So I had no choice but to make this thing work. So I had to visualize here in my mind's eye first. I had to see the success that I wanted here. And I had to feel it. I, I had to see what it, see what it was in my mind and feel what it was going to feel like when I reached six figures. Because yes. that's exactly what I was going yes. for was six figures. So I started at zero. Actually, negative. I went beyond <laughs> zero. <laughs> beyond zero, right? And so when I started this business, 
I used to tell myself with every single door knock, with every single phone call, whether it was a good phone call, hey, we set an appointment, cool, KMF, right? Instead of saying keep moving forward, I kept it simple, KMF, right? If I had somebody shut the door in my face, slam the door, hang up on me, you know what, GB? Brush your shoulders off, KMF. And it became a habit, right? It, I, I, and, and I'm speaking to the real people here, right? This is real oh, people, yes, right? They're real people. You have things that go on in your mind every day telling you to quit, telling you to give up, telling you not to, to continue with what you're doing. Is you it get for that, me? You get that, is it for me? Right. It, you know, feeling uncomfortable, almost feeling paralyzed because you're thinking too much. I, I know I'm not the only one, right? So I had to stop that, and, there was, and, and that was a trigger to keep me moving in the process, right? KMF, good things happening, all right? Great, let's move on, KMF, bad things happening. No worries, KMF. And just staying consistent with that tone in my mind was what led me to go from, in 2010, at zero dollars, to about two and a half years later, making six figures in this business and continually making now multiple six figures mm -hmm. with this industry. Let me also add, I've been, I've been with this company for almost 10 years now. This is the longest that I've ever been with anything except for my marriage, wow. right? And the interesting thing about that is that I made a declaration I, and, and I kind of thought in my mind with the woman that I have, who is my wife, what it was gonna be like to be married to her, right? What that was gonna feel like to have her in my life till death do us part. Didn't even realize I was living the KMF philosophy by living through our marriage, through our relationship, right? So it just tied into our business, right? And now seven years in a row, we have gone to multiple six figures and we continue to grow. So my message to you is very simple. Whatever it is that you're going for, it could be real estate, it could be mortgages, it could be the insurance industry, whatever it is, right? Make a decision here first. See it in your mind. Feel what it's going to look like. You know, really describe it in your mind what it's going to look like and feel that feeling of when you accomplish it, right? Then make the commitment. KMF is the is the bridge between what you're thinking and what you're feeling and the results that you're looking for. Right? Now you can follow me on uh, at the KMF Advantage on Instagram. I also have an apparel line. If you wanna if you wanna rep the brand that keeps you moving forward towards your goals, your dreams, your destiny, this is it right here. If you need a reminder, if you're out in the field, you need a reminder, wear the shirt underneath. And then you can look in the mirror after you have something and just say, hey, KMF, let's keep it moving, right? But you rep, rep the brand that's going to keep you moving forward towards your dreams, your goals, and your destiny. I'm so thankful for the opportunity to be on this today. Thank you so much, Chrissy, for giving oh, me, the, yes. give me a, a, a chance to speak to the folks. All right. Absolutely. And Absolutely. I'm out. All right, guys. So this is being sold out, right? Keep moving forward. There's, I definitely wanted to have Gabe jump on here because he is one of the individuals throughout my seven years, oh my God, my seven years here that we have worked together and we consistently here keep moving forward. When you're having a good day, you keep moving forward. If you have those three and four sales before one o'clock in the afternoon, you keep moving forward and finish out the rest of your day because tomorrow you may not receive an app or, the or two or three days. It may take a couple days before you help another family. So you have to keep moving forward. This is a mindset. Do not quit on your goals. Do not quit on your dreams. Do not quit on your vision because all you're doing is quitting on you.